Now the next thing uh, that we're going to do is we're going to do like we did with the stick. We're going to, uh, after the thrust, I'm going to do a strike. So we're going to enter, no footwork, okay? Then I'm going to thrust, and then I'm going to strike, and then back down. So I'm going to enter, thrust, strike, down. All right, now you see that? It's still the same lines, except now we're raising the level by adding another strike. So that means that within those lines, there has to be a defense that's created. Watch again. So we go here, I thrust, I come down, I change direction, and come, and there's my movement again. Okay, so this is my movement, my thrust and my movement, because I'm using sparadaga, right? Okay, now we're going to do, uh, replace that strike with a thrust. So we're going to go here, I'm going to thrust here, and then add another thrust with the blade, and then come down and enter. Thrust, thrust, and then enter, thrust, thrust, and then back, 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 thrust. Two thrusts, one with the blade, one with the long blade, machete, and then clearing, and then enter, and then thrust, and then thrust, and clearing, and enter. All right, again, raising the level of the training, of the understanding that it could be a strike, it could be a thrust, but as long as you understand those lines, it's easier to recognize in a... Um, in real time, when I say real time, it's like it, it fast, like reality. We don't we don't punch slow, or we don't you know stop and pose, or, or, or you know for uh, uh, in real time. Okay, this is all done fast movement and with footwork, which we're going to demonstrate now. Okay, so I'm going to add it with the strike. We're going to go forward. One thrust, strike down. One thrust, strike down. One thrust, thrust down. One thrust, thrust, and then back down. like boom 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 like 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 patty cake that that it may look like that because we're just here but if we do three count combinations and I come in one drop here, here and then I move and then I come back and I go pop, 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 and then I come back and I'm in my motion and then I come in pop, drop, here, here, and then I come back then you see that becomes reality this little thing that we're doing here is to develop those lines so I can use them in three count combinations to enter to make them applicable in what I'm doing. And then now, we're gonna use the thrust. We're gonna start off slow. One, thrust, thrust, down, one, thrust, thrust, down, and here we go. And there we go. And then I move, and then when I enter, when I move and I enter, and I go, ha, 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 ha. and I come back, and I'm moving, this is my movement, my movement, my movement, right? My movement, and I enter, and then whoa, and then come back. See, there was a misbeat, move back, protect. All this can be done if we learn these lines. If you see that, once you start moving, get a little short breath, maybe start getting tired, your arms start getting a little heavy because of the weapons. So imagine if you're only used to Training, standing still, and in a straddle stance, just doing movements. You have to have a right lead, you have to have a left lead, you have to switch grips lead, you have to switch grips lead, you have to know what type of grips to use, you have to know your, your weapon and your position, how you hold it, how you exchange from the grip so I can move to the other hand. Okay, if I need to, what if this hand gets cut and I need to switch grips because now, this hand is badly hurt. I can use this as a secondary, but then my good hand, I can also train to protect. Okay, it's the same thing on the other side, if that hand gets hurt. And that's the application of lines using espada y daga.